All right, I'm going to show you some new neat things in Safari. First of all, let's go ahead and open it up. Ka-ching! It comes to this landing page that I have. And in here, I've got all my favorites, supposedly. I didn't really put them in there. They it auto-generated. Uh, then I got Frequently Visit. And you can, you know, open that up more or less. You can open this up more or less. And then down here, it tells me about my privacy reports. Then it's got a reading list. And then it's got stuff that I looked at on my iPhone. But what I want to show you is a cool thing that you can do. You can have multiple tabs open, and you can leave them open if you want. And if you want to look at them all, you can come here and just go like this. And what it does is it lays them out in front of you. Now, let's say you want to add one. What it's going to do is it's going to bring you to a page like this, if I click here. And then I could add something like, let's uh, add Google. All right. So now if we go back and we click on these four little boxes up here, bam, there I am. Now you could leave these things open if you want to, which I don't recommend, but you could. And if you wanted to add one, you could just go here and click. And you could add another one. Let's uh, add, uh, oh, let's add whatever this is. I have no idea what it is. It's Beanmo. Oh, look at that. <laughs> and so then let's go like this. All right, and so it just keeps going like that, all right? And here's another add button you can use. You can click this, and you could put something on there like Facebook. It's taking a while to download. So now we're in Facebook. Let's click here. So if you look, up here you got your start page. You got YouTube, which is here. You got Google here. You got Beanmo here. You got Facebook there, and then you got your ad box here. And that's pretty much how it works. And then if you notice, they've changed the way these look. You know, now there's little gaps between them. And when you run your finger over, they kind of shade out into a gray shade. You see that? So those are some of the changes. But it's the same way. You know, if you wanted to go to, to YouTube, I could go like that, right? If I wanted to go back to this page and I wanted to shoot over to Venmo or Vimeo, I could go like that, right? So... These are some of the things that you can do with Safari and some of the changes on them. Um, to get out of this, you, it's the same thing. Click, 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 and bam, Bob's your uncle. And then if you want to get out of Safari completely, click. All right, if you like this video, subscribe to my channel and check out my other awesome videos. Peace out.